This is a WordJack video on how to import email addresses to your lists on MailChimp. One of the great things about MailChimp is its ability to easily import multiple email addresses. And here's how. We're going to log into MailChimp, and what we want to do is import our email addresses that we have here on this Excel spreadsheet. It's a short list for this demo, but it could be a list of a thousand customers. On this spreadsheet, we have email addresses among other contact information. Our list in MailChimp has been set up to store this information. So let's import as much of this customer information as possible. In MailChimp, click on Lists, and then choose which list we want to add the addresses to. Now, under the Add Subscribers option, we'll select Import Subscribers. Add, you can do one at a time if you want to and import will allow multiple editions in one go. That's what we want. We want to copy paste from file. This is a really great feature from MailChimp. Choose this method and click next at the bottom right. And now we can paste all the information we want from our spreadsheet right here. So we'll select all this information, including the headers, hit Control C to copy, and Control V to paste right here in MailChimp. Check the box stating that we understand and then click next. Now what MailChimp does is tries to match the fields that are in the data you've pasted with the fields that are in the structure of your MailChimp list. So you can skip columns that you don't need and save what you want. And in some cases, it even predicts the destination field based on the data available. My list has a lot of information about each subscriber, but if you're just pasting a list of names and emails, this is really fast. Now that we're finished, click next, and now we're all set to import. We do want to add these as subscribers. If the email address is already in your MailChimp list, it won't create a duplicate record. It will either skip the import field or update your database with the extra info if you click update. And finally, click import. Depending on the size of your list, this may take a while. In this case, it was rather quick. As you could see here, MailChimp is verifying three subscribers have been added. Now I can view the list right here with all the customer information imported too. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact your WordJack marketing manager.